Hi, it's Marianne, the Frugal Chef. Why don't we make some minestrone with the meatballs we made the other day? <laughs> Let's make this. It's an easy, very, very fresh soup. I love it. Let's make this. Let's start our soup. I have some olive oil in this pan, and I'm going to add a large fennel bulb that I just diced, a medium white onion that I diced, you know, chopped coarsely, and two carrots, which I just, you know, chopped. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna let this cook for about 10 minutes until our carrots are starting to shine, they get the onions and the fennel start to soften, and then I'll come back. 10 minutes have gone by, these vegetables are beautiful. They're starting to brown a little bit. They're nice and shiny and soft. Beautiful. I'm going to add a small summer squash and a small zucchini. All I did was just cut them like this. I'm gonna mix this and we're gonna let these cook now for about four minutes. You know, be careful with your heat. You don't want your heat to be too high and, and start burning the vegetables that are already brown. I'm gonna add about three quarters cup of frozen corn kernels. Don't worry that if they're not thawed, they're gonna thaw in here anyway. And about a cup of small pasta. Typically, you would use little shells for this. I have little elbows. I don't wanna go buy little shells. Just use whatever you know, small pasta you have, but typically uh, you would use small, uh, small shells. I'm gonna add a 14 ounce can of cannellini beans. You know, cannellini beans are white kidney beans. You can also use red kidney beans for this or garbanzo beans. You know, very versatile our little soup. So now let's add about 16 meatballs to this. And let's add uh, six cups of uh, chicken stock. Oh, oh, yes. Let's season this. I'm gonna salt it. Put some black pepper in here. And a little bit of oregano. The last thing I'm gonna add in here is a 14 uh, ounce can of diced tomatoes. All right, let's let this cook and I'll see you guys in about 10, 15 minutes. Our soup is almost finished. It's simmered for about, I'm gonna say 17 minutes, but everything in there is nice and cooked. So perfect, I'm gonna turn the heat off. In here I have a, a cup, a heaping cup of spinach leaves that I just cut, you know, uh, baby spinach leaves. And I also have, I'm gonna say about two, two and a half tablespoons of basil that I just chopped. So I'm just gonna put all these herbs in here and these vegetables. All we're gonna do is mix this, and we're just gonna let the ba this uh, the basil and the spinach uh, wilt. That's it. We don't need to cook it any further. Our soup is done. So let's give this a few minutes. Ay ay ay! God, this is good. And we'll serve it. Okay, my friends, let's get ready to eat. Ah, this looks good. I'm gonna go ahead and add parmesan. Uh, cheese into our soup. <laughs> ah, I'm gonna serve this with some nice crusty bread. Bon appetit my friends from thefrugochef.com. Make sure you come and see us. We have all kinds of recipes that are not in video form. Eat well without going broke. I will see you guys soon.